because right now it's time for us to crack this open the 2020 1984 Audi Quattro Super Trajan on it's the 5 all right so if you like our diecast videos don't forget to subscribe like the channel and ring that bell so you can get up to date notifications on all the new videos that are uploaded as they come out also check out our instagram and twitter we up those we up those we update those <laughs> also on a daily basis so check it out we are everywhere people like spider-man all right so here we go we're gonna crack this open but before we crack this open uh, on one of our other videos, uh, I forgot which one was that, the, the one we did, the Super Trader, the 69 Chevy truck, the 2021. So, what was the guy's name? Some, some, one of our viewers asked us, or well, said, a Super is one out of 900 cars, and a regular hunt is one out of 50, so that's why the markups are so high. So... What we're, I think that's from SJC77. Yeah. So thanks for the comment, but we're just curious. How did you come to that conclusion? Did you did you look it up? Did you find out how much? Because it's one out of 900, and a regular trend on is one out of 50. So we're just curious. Yeah? Yeah, we want to know. Where can we find that details? Because we never knew that. Yeah, and if that's true, that's a trip. I was like, wow. We're not trying to fact check. We just want to make sure that if we start yeah. repeating that, then... Yeah, then... if we repeat that, we don't like look stupid. Yeah. <laughs> well, more stupid than what we are. <laughs> so I guess it is kind of a quasi-fact check. We're just trying to make sure that it's uh, it's <laughs> comes from solid ground. Yeah, and so, so yeah, we, that's all we're trying to do. Like, um, hit us up, let us know, and um, cool, man. We appreciate that. All right, yeah. so let's crack this open right here, man. Yep. Yeah, so this is the Super Treasure Hunt um, membership for 2020. So it is Super Treasure Hunts from the year 2020, calendar year. So it starts in January and goes to December. Oh, that last Super Treasure Hunt we opened, the flame didn't have anything written on it, and this one does. Cool. I know. I see some that do, some that don't. Yeah, I, I remember seeing those only on the regular treasure hunts, but not on the supers. But that's that's cool. I like. I like and that. I only can say that because I only just look at yours and you bust yours open because <laughs> I don't have any that they crack open. So I wouldn't know. <laughs> it's just when we bust yours open, I notice it sometimes. Yeah, and, and I've been opening. I I had the subscription last year also for for 2019, but I didn't open them because they were coming. I didn't. I didn't get them consistently one per month. They would come two one in one month, yeah. and then I wouldn't get any for. So I wasn't. I didn't know how to plan the the filming of that because it was so sporadic. But uh, this year we just decided, you know, whatever comes in the mail, we'll just open it. It's not going to be in any yeah. order. So I will say this: the paint job on that is really nice. It looks like a candy red. Oh yeah, it's done. It's it's like that um, the Audi wagon. The Audi wagon was the other uh, Spectra Flame Red. Yeah. Which is kind of cool because this is a VW. So, no, this is an Audi, right? Audi, yeah. That's right. This is Audi. If it, if this was a VW, this would be the Scirocco. Yeah, right? Scirocco or Golf. No, yeah. Yeah. But, you know. Well, it wouldn't be Golf because that's a different, different the, color. The, the color on that is so nice. I'm just overlooking the white rims. <laughs> 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 I like the color so much. I was like, that's a really, really alluring candy red. And I'm not even, you know, I, I, I will forego the shape of the car and the fact that it has white rims. So, you know, it's all good, bro. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, everybody, everybody knows, you know, Chrome does work out. Everything, I know that you like, sorry, moving stuff around. Um, I know that you like everything with chrome rims. Uh, I'm kind of a hit and miss. I do like the chrome. I do prefer the chrome. But there are some times where I do like uh, the rim that it comes on. And the reason why I'm making a lot of noise in the background is I took the, sh the dust shield off of my display with all the cards in it. And while we're going over this, I'm going to record some 
video of the display where I have the other eight supercharger hunts from this year. And well, I'll have to say this. i got to interject and say, yeah, I like chrome a lot or polished aluminum, not just chrome. It has to be like, I'd rather have the luster of highly polished aluminum, that detailed chrome, any day. The high luster of polished aluminum, billet aluminum, whatever, blows chrome. Second would be chrome. Now, you are right. Some cars, blacked out rims look way better, you know, or, you know, or color coordinated rims look way better. But that's few and far between. The majority is when you get, like, you know, uh, a specific rim for a specific car. You know, chrome just seems to stand, well, or polish seems to stand out better. Plus, back in the day, I like it so much because I couldn't afford it. You know, back in the day, I had to do the whole spray your rim black and put the chrome rim trim, you know. Not everybody had money to go out and buy a rim. These guys nowadays, but they get cash. I don't know where to get it from, but they go out there, buy, like, Japan rims that run them, like, five grand, you know, buy all these custom rims that run them about, you know, a couple grand, bro. You know, when we are building cars, never cost that much. But to us at that time for that era was a lot. So not everybody had that. So, you know, the best thing that you could do, the cheapest way was to spray the rim black. Yep. You know what yep. I mean? So And the new technology now with Plasti Dip. I mean, yeah, black, Plasti Dip black rims was a thing for a little while until yeah. Plasti Dip did different colors. And now you have different colors. And then you have dipped rims where you can put yep. images in paint on your rims. It yeah. goes if if Mattel ever did that to that, that would That'd be, be a trip. That would be yeah. That would be pretty difficult to fight, to fight with. But it the I mean the images would be so small on those rims. We would make out. You know what? what it is. I mean, if they wanted to shut us up, they'll probably, probably just do it so we shut up. <laughs> if they want to shut us up, <laughs> they would send us something. <laughs> <laughs> They want to shut us up, sponsor us. <laughs> <laughs> then they can pull the strings and go, hey, hey. <laughs> we, you know, we, you guys will know we got sponsored when we start going, you know, I really like I really like those hubcaps and those, those yeah. Neo rims look great. <laughs> yeah, and those, I'm um, trying to look for them right now if we have any of the pizza cutter ones. <laughs> oh, yeah. Pizza cutter rims, you know, they're yeah. fantastic. And we start talking about fantasy cars like they're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. how you know we got sponsored, guys. <laughs> so I wanted to, I I noticed this on the side, but I have uh, the mainline version of the same car. The look at non- the size of the rims on the mainline. And look at the size of the rims on the Super. Yeah. Smaller. Like, one has 17 inch, the other one has 15 inch. <laughs> paint job is big difference though <laughs> oh yeah way different way different i and i think i mentioned in the the last video one of the previous videos that i was looking at making a red collection <laughs> oh yeah 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 okay yeah. making that red collection it's be- why well, it would include that kind of red too because we have all of the reds like that kind of red oh yeah right and i think i pulled the porsche this red and then the aston martins came with red you gotta do the ferrari red now oh yeah i've got the ferrari reds which is behind me in the case so i i don't, don't want to take that one out but i can and the momo the, the 510 momo red Oh yeah, we have that too. But I'm gonna show, take some quick video of the Ferrari Reds. Yeah, only, only, you know, only Porsche and Ferrari can just say, "What kind of red is that?" It's a Ferrari Red. <laughs> it's yeah. a Porsche Red. Does Porsche make a red? Is it? I don't know. They make a... I'm assuming they do. I mean. You would think. I mean, I mean that's the most when, iconic when, color on there. Yeah, the when car. you're like when you're that when you're that high up on the on the food chain for exotic cars, you know what I mean? That's 
that the average public can well not the average public but the 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 slightly above middle class people can afford yeah and we're not talking all the hyper all the hyper um hybrid cars no not like the one two three four five ten twelve million dollar hyper sport cars the one there's only like six in the world and four got damaged, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> four got abandoned in Dubai, and then everybody just got the rest. Well, you know, that's what I want to do. I want to open up a junkyard out there, and it's everybody just bring their cars to me, and I can do my own, um, what do you call? Uh, uh, admin, 10,000 mile guy, boss two, uh, <laughs> 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 um, restore restorations. <laughs> yeah, restorations on free luxury sport and hyper sport cars. Yeah. Yeah. Today we got this Lamborghini uh, Diablo. <laughs> yeah, and it's got. We're this just gonna wicked, polish it out. <laughs> it's got this wicked crank in the door. Who, when you open it, it goes key. You know, we're gonna put <laughs> we're gonna put lube on it, and we just restored it. <laughs> we're gonna put some lube on it. We're gonna wash it. We're gonna polish it. And there we go. We're gonna sell it for you know a hundred thousand dollars. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna paint the rims black on this Pantera. <laughs> yeah, you know. So, because yeah, yeah, we kind of went far off topic. <laughs> yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. So we're the over stories. eleven minutes in in this video. So thanks everybody for staying this far in the video. And don't forget to like the video, share the video with your friends, family, coworkers. People you play with, people you see in the store, people you buy ice cream with, and also people that look exactly like you. All right, and check out our second channel, Cody Diecast. Check out our Instagram and Twitter pages. We are H Dub Five O. All you new viewers out there, big ups to you. Thanks for hanging out, staying this long. We do appreciate it. Uh, if you check out our end screen, you see links to our previous video, a video YouTube thinks you like, and a link to our second channel. Cody Diecast. We got more stuff coming up, so just put some glue on your butt and stay right there. We'll be back. Swoops.